Awo nela ba. Awo ira ba. Bulungi. Nemvi risigwa. Hehe. <laughs> Hi guys, how are you doing? I hope you guys are doing well. Uh, I'm doing okay today. I'm doing really okay today. And um, hmm. so I want to say thank you for the love, guys, for all the love you guys are showing me. You're amazing. I don't know. I need to find something to hold the camera. But anyway, I need to say thank you so much for all the love that you are sharing, that you are showering me with. I am very, very grateful. Anyway, in today's vlog, we are not doing so much. We are just um, going to put up a fence. Yes, we are going to put up a fence for our garden. Yeah, we are going to put up a fence for our garden so that Emmy doesn't destroy. You see what she's been doing to the maze? Yeah, it's down. It's down. The bins. And then I have insects, but I'm going to get pesticides. See? This is what Emmy is doing to the garden. You literally can see. My cassava, she comes here and plays and makes sure she uproots everything. <laughs> she is no joke. Yeah, that. Um, and so if we are to eat any maize in a few days time to come, in a few months time to come, we have to put up a fence. And thank you so much, Miss Linda. Thank you. For making this happen you are amazing thank you so 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 much uh yeah this is the the wires that we are going to use how is it called eh uh, you see i have limited editions when it comes to english this is what we could get for now this is what we could afford for now let's see how big let's see how how long it takes us and i have my friend here mr michael who happens to drive me around most of the time he's going to be getting the poles that we are supposed to be using today to put up the what the cafe and so we'll make it a little bit temporary um to see what happens next yay i don't know if it will be enough for all this but let's see then i have insects you can see some leaves are yellow but maybe tomorrow when i go to town then i you see the leaves are yellow now i need to get off these see see the insects see 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 see, see the pests See, 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 the pests that are making our plants yellow. Yeah, so I need to get pesticides as soon as possible to make sure we remain with a pest-free garden. I think the pests affected this side mostly. This side looks okay. Our pumpkin is basically doing all right. And I can also see yellow leaves. But maybe these are because they were the first leaves. So they've edged. Enough, I can't wait for the first pumpkin. <laughs> I can't wait for the pump first pumpkin. And then I have to do the weeding in a few days time. Yeah, but uh, meanwhile, guys. As all that is going on, I am very, 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 very sad to announce to you that we lost uh, Miss Grace or Madame Grace. You remember Madame Grace? She's, um, she's the lady from Tororo. Uh, we were trying to build a toilet for her. And then I got also very kind of fixed up with my own stuff. And I thought, okay, let me first find a place to sleep. Then I'll go finish up her toilet. And then the Lord didn't allow that to happen. 
sadly so she's passed on and uh, it's really 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 sad uh, I don't know <laughs> I don't know what to do life is really short life is really really very unpredictable because I was like dang I think now my house is at this stage now I am capable of doing so many things that I wouldn't do yeah and that's when the Lord chose to take her so it's a very sad day as I make this film but I have to make it I have to do it yeah so I will be traveling I think with Caro and then um, I still had a few clothes that were given to me by one of my friends to take to her grandkids and I hope I can deliver that as soon as I can yeah tomorrow preferably and uh, let's see what happens eh na ye racho simi wa neno tutandikira wali eri wagulu omuti eh wakati makatandikira kenge nakitandikira eh sande ka ina kutandikira wali anti njagala yo gundi nge sigadde wabweru obo busubi i want this grass to remain okay Eh, yeah, the grass should remain this way. Take maybe this way, like this. Hmm. Take her. No, jamu e janja viyange tu genda kweku. Oh, that is soft. So he's trying to make poles. Na eto kola like too 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 deep. You know you unkumani. I know what deep. Na tu kumani. Okay, I'm gonna eat. Eh. So he's saying that the pole should be a bit deeper if the Eh you are sure katimba kali katuke no yona Eh Eh Hmm So when you start building, <laughs> there are things that become a must. You have to buy a hammer, you have to buy an X, X, O, X, O, X, O, I forgot the word, X, O, not an axe. Um, I forgot, I forgot. <laughs> but anyway, you have to get holes, you have to get ensururu. <laughs> you have to get hammer, you have to get wheelbarrow, you have to get a small tank to collect water, oh, you gel cans to fetch water in case you don't have water yet in your compound. Yo, <laughs> it's kind of a tough thing to do. So, but I can't say thank you enough to you miss linda for making this happen because you love emmy's freedom so much so you think <laughs> you love emmy's freedom so much and you you bought for us this net which is really amazing and later if i don't have any more plants we can use it to you know create a house for the hens or the chicken or whatever so I made sure I buy something that is long lasting that we can use later on. Then it's around 18 inches. Yeah, they say it's around 18 inches. And this is strong and long lasting. It's heavy. I can't carry it. Mr. Man is doing it for me. <laughs> So these are the some of the trees. Um, they don't call them trees anymore. Poles, yeah. The poles I've been using to to build and to do the plastering. Yeah, that's the only plastering I've done so far. <laughs> 
You can see my bucket because now I have to bathe from here. Yeah, that's my bathroom for now. That's my bucket that I'm using for now. And that's the tank or, yeah. That's the tank that I'm using to store some water, especially water to clean Emmy's dishes. Um, water to do other domestic, uh, domestic work. I store the water here. Yeah, and maybe uh, sometime soon, you see that the upper side, I will put um, water collectors and then they will collect water into this paper. Then I can have water. I haven't washed my dishes today. <laughs> Your girl has not washed her dishes for today, but uh, I'm going to wash them. This is the charcoal stove, which I use to cook Emmy's food. Yeah. And the her plates are also here. They are not washed yet. And so this is Emmy's doll, which she doesn't play with anymore. She doesn't like dirty things. And unfortunately, there is no way I can keep this clean because the house is still not tiled or cemented. This ground is like this. So definitely when she brings it out, it's going to get dirty and she doesn't like it so she leaves it here and then this is where i burn my trash from i'm still burning the trash i collect it like this like the wet trash this way and then the bar the things that i can burn on this side and then yeah it's been raining so i can't burn stuff and then mr michael here is still helping me do the hard work <laughs> That I'm lazy to do. I can do all this work, I promise, but I'm lazy. So he's done doing all the holes here, like you can see. All the holes are done. We've had to ask that from the neighbor. What is this called? Kanobaka Itavatia, this one. We've had to ask that from the neighbor because mine was stolen by the builders, the first builders. Axo, it's called Axo Blade. <laughs> Mr. Michael here is very kind to me and very helpful. So I'm I'm grateful he's here. So I have got your touch sala. All about all sala, Mr. Michael Uleke. Yeah. So Mr. Michael here is uh, my border, border person. If I want to go somewhere, he makes it convenient for me. Big more, more, more. <coughs> the holes are done. Oh, no, Nyachi, Miss Somali. Oh, my lady, and you need to be Guess one pole is already put. Uh huh. This one. This is actually Emmy's favorite spot. Yeah. Emmy's favorite place because 
she can peep here. Let me show you why this is happening. She can peep through the gate here and see people. So it's so easy for her to play around here. <laughs> and uh, mm -hmm. let's see what happens. Meanwhile, the poles look kind of spaced. I don't know. We might have to put in. Katia, do you know Zinigaye nyo? I have to make sure I leave enough space for trucks that are bringing materials like bricks and cement and sand to park. Not to come and change because they have to put sand there. the fence is up i think it looks really beautiful it wasn't enough to fence off the whole long garden but it was very very important because i was able to fence off the place that amy and lucky loves to play around which is next to the gate and also they can't get in here i don't know why i've observed for the last few days they just can't use the other hole to get into so this was very 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 helpful thank you miss linda so much for this fence may god bless you <laughs> thank you for loving us